If your Panasonic Smart TV has a black screen but you still hear sound or see lights, don't panic. In this quick guide, I'll show you how to do a full hard reset and bring your screen back to life. Let's get started. First, we'll try a basic power cycle. This one's super simple and often works. Step one, unplug your TV from the wall. Step two, find the physical power button on the TV, not the remote, and press and hold it for 30 to 60 seconds. This drains out any leftover electricity inside. Step three, now wait, at least 15 to 30 minutes. The longer, the better. It helps clear out deeper software bugs. Then plug it back in and turn it on. If the screen still stays black, don't worry. We'll try something more powerful next. Let's try a forced factory reset. You don't need a remote for this. Method A, most models. Unplug the TV, press and hold the volume down and power buttons on the TV panel. While holding, plug the power back in. Keep holding until you see an erasing screen. This can take up to a minute. If that doesn't work, try method B, especially for older models. Unplug again. Hold the menu button and volume down together. Plug in the power while still holding both. Release when the reset screen shows up. Still no luck? A few things to check. Shine a flashlight on the screen. See a faint image? Your backlight might be dead. Check the LED light on your TV. Solid green or red. Try the reset again. Blinking or flashing. Count the flashes. They might mean a hardware issue, like a faulty board. Also, try plugging in a DVD player or game console using HDMI. If that shows up, the problem might be your cable or input device. If none of these fixes help, it could be a hardware issue. Don't open the TV yourself. It's risky and may void your warranty. If your TV is still under warranty, contact Panasonic support or your retailer. Hope this helped you fix your Panasonic Smart TV. If it did, give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more quick tech fixes. See you in the next video.